What up, Grand? It's your granddad. Just you got a black abstract. You're locked in once again. I appreciate you. Listen, sorry I've been absent for so long. But, you know, it's 4th of July weekend. I was getting my swerve on. I was doing a bunch of things, man. But, uh, Succession. I don't know if you're a Succession fans. It comes on HBO Max or HBO in general. Uh, I got into this uh, during the pandemic. Watched the first two seasons, and, man, I was blown away, man. One thing about me... I love white mess. I love messy white folk, especially when they got a lot of money. And that's what succession is all about. Messy white folk with a lot of money. So uh, pretty much about um, a business owner uh, named Logan, who owns a media broadcasting company, has a bunch of subsidiaries underneath him. And uh, he he was supposed to retire. And his son was supposed to take over the business. He decided not to because they felt like his son wasn't ready. And uh, the whole show is pretty much based on him finding a successor and just the shit that goes on in between. And it's a lot that goes on in between. I'm talking about from murder to sabotage, blackmail, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. And you name it, it happens. So uh, they dropped a teaser for season three. It's been a long wait. I believe almost a year and a half, if not longer. Uh, so let's check it out. You are Kendall Roy. You are fucking Kendall Roy. Is it true? He's on his way? Uh, I don't see him yet. With his stupid walk. No drama. <laughs> We're good. Don't go to fucking jail. <laughs> the revolution will be televised. He's our dad. No. But he was going to send me to jail. He'd do the same to all of us. Chef, are you okay? Are you part of this family or not? If I back you against death, you would need to let me take over. Whoa, Nelly. Everyone's going to battle in armor, and I'm sitting here exposed. Logan is going to fire a million poisonous spiders down your dicky. That that sounds like kind of dramatic, Tom. <laughs> Ask yourself, do you want to be on the side of good, good. or evil? You tell him, I'm going to grind these fucking bones to make my bread. He says he's going to grind your bones to make his bread. (laughs) Okay, tell him that I'm going to run up off the fucking beanstalk. (laughs) What the fuck is that? Like nice laughing. Yeah, man, I'm ready, man. I'm ready. It's good to see. It was good to see the old gang. All back together again. Uh, like I said, man, it's white mess. Everybody trying to play each other against each other. Uh, now Shiv's about to get thrown into the mix, mix to where she has to choose sides. And uh, I believe she was supposed to be next in line and take over the company when Logan had control. But at, as we, you remember, the season finale, uh, season two, uh, Logan got thrown under the bus. Um so we'll see what happens. I'm, I'm, I'm very interested to see how this is gonna go. Uh, you know, somebody had to take the hit for uh, uh, the the stuff that was going on on these secret cruises and yachts, and Tom thought he was gonna get take the hit, and then I guess Kendall wind up uh, being informed that he was gonna take the hit, and then at the last second he decides to throw Logan completely under the bus. In a, uh, a, a turn of events that we didn't see happening, and um, now uh, everybody's reeling from the aftermath of that, and uh, everybody's clamoring to, I guess, pick their their particular alliances. Uh, so uh, it's gonna be good, man. It's gonna be good. Shiv was spitting in the book, and I'm like, what is she doing? Um, what's the younger brother's name again? He's he's like my favorite. I can't believe it. I'm drawing a blank. It's been so long since I watched it. Uh but he, he's he's funny as hell. McCulkin. Uh his last name is McCulkin. He's related to Macaulay Culkin. What the fuck is his name? Ah, I'm weird. It's been a long day. But um I'm yeah, I'm 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 very excited to see this. Uh I've been waiting like everybody else. Um Kendall still has to get his bearings, man. He he gotta come. You remember uh, Logan said, yo, you not ready. You got to have that killer instinct. Uh, I think he's getting there, but he got he to gotta work on his comebacks. He got to work on his snapbacks because uh, I'm going to run off the beanstalk. What the fuck? What is that? What is that? And uh, we got to see uh, Kendall do another rap. You remember last season he did a rap 
for his dad. What it was it? Uh, <laughs> that joke is fire too. Chilling with the pop. What the fuck? What he said? Ah, that shit was it was hilarious though. But I like the little rap he had. We got to see another one, Kendall. Um, I think Logan will somehow re re he'll get he'll regain power again because Logan, you can't you can't you can't sleep on the old dog, man. You can't sleep on the old dog, especially with somebody that had the hat in the ring for so long. Kendall better watch his step, man, because Logan coming for blood now, and there ain't going to be no remorse this time. So, Kendall, you got to be just as shysty, if not shystier. Uh, <laughs> but we'll see what happens. Uh, make sure you post your comments below. Uh, like, subscribe. Tell me what your predictions are of this season. Uh, who's going to get shipped? Who's going to get uh, sent up the river? Who's going to come out on top? Uh, Till next time. Peace.